July's box for this year. Um, and so real quickly here before we dive in, I'm just going to take show you a quick picture uh, like I normally do and show you how it looks like when you unbox the uh, unbox it yourself. So, yeah. <laughs> Okay, so again, the first thing that you see is the card, which obviously has all the stuff on the back. So this one says pretty in pink, and then it has the stuff on the back, which this one actually has a bride on it. This is the first one that actually has a uh, print on the other side, so that's kind of cool. So when you open it up, like, the first thing that you see, which I am so so surprised okay I did take a little peek before <laughs> so um, yeah but seriously this I was not expecting to get something so nice like this I don't have anything like this at all so this is like so cool um, but yeah let me show it to you so it says Mrs. on there comes with a little spoon and a little cover and this is the inside looks all marbleized and same thing with this so that is super 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 cool like probably the nicest mug I've ever owned so <laughs> that's really cool um, so the retail value of this mug, which I'm sure is going to be, like, super expensive. Um, oh, okay, so it's about $30. So, so apparently it's a hand wash only, so very delicate. But, yeah, so that retailed for about $30. Um, this looks like it's not a wifey shirt. And, no, it is a bride shirt. Cool. So... Yeah, it just says bright on it. Pretty simple. Um, pretty clear cut. So, yeah, so far all of the clothes that I've gotten for them have been true to size. Um, I am a large, so that's what I put in for my size. And everything seems like it fits just fine, which is great. Um, I'm definitely wearing that. Um, so, this pink also retails for $30. Now this is really cool. Um, it's like another, I've got another scrub thing. So that was like the first thing that I got in my March box was a little uh, sugar scrub thing. So that's what this is. It says non-GMO. So that's really cool. And it's about 10 ounces. Really, really good for for the size. So that's pretty much how it looks like. And let's see. I actually want to smell it. I haven't smelt it yet. Smells pretty good. Um, so this sugar scrub retails for about 12 bucks. And yeah, it just has a bunch of different oils on it. Um, again, seed, uh, some sort of seed oil, kernel oil, rosemary. Um, and a bunch of other stuff that I can't really pronounce. Um, I can pronounce argan oil. <laughs> but yeah, so that's, that was, that was really cool. And again, that was like, what, 12 bucks? Yeah. Yeah. And let's see. So this, oh, that's pretty cool. So I'm sure we've all heard of dry shampoo, but have you heard of dry conditioner? Look at this. This is conditioner in a can, so um, if you have a dry shampoo, then there you go. You can dry condition as well, which I think is actually really cool. So the some of the stuff I did actually forget about, so I'm not, I am surprised with some of the stuff. But the dry conditioner, um, that was about 10 bucks, so yeah, definitely that makes sense. So this is the last thing in here, and, oh yes, I remember this, okay, so this, kind of cool, 
just like a little pendant and it says wifey on it yeah so that's kind of cute it's like rose gold so it's really nice and you can wear it with like anything um so the wifey rose gold necklace retailed for about 25 bucks so yeah like stuff for this month was exceeded my expectations for this month and so I'm really excited. I'm definitely going to bring that bride shirt to my bachelorette party this weekend. So that's going to be cool. So if you have found this video helpful, like and subscribe. And um, yeah, share to your friends or, you know, anybody else who is thinking about getting a bridal box. And, you know, maybe this will help them make a decision. Um, because like I mentioned in my first video, I was taking a look at other options like Miss to Mrs. Um, there was a couple others that I, I can't remember right now. But I remember taking a look at all of them and I was watching a lot of different YouTube videos. And that's actually why I've decided to make YouTube videos as well to help other people if they're kind of in a similar situation. And there weren't many, uh, there weren't too many something new bridal box videos that I was able to find. So, but the ones that I did, they actually had a lot better stuff than the other boxes that I was seeing and the price, you know, just how much I'm spending for the box. I wanted to get something, you know, I just wanted nice things and I wanted like, like everything else just kind of seemed like it was a lot more cheaply made or just random things. So these are just like really thoughtful items that were given. So I really love it. I think it's great. So yeah um can't wait for next month and yeah so that's pretty much it and uh have a good day see you later bye <laughs>